Okay, let's make a start. Morning everybody, really nice to see you all again. Uh, oh, hang on, hang on, hang on. Let's see if that's better. Fab. So yeah, I'll try and get um, all the videos from last week are up on the YouTube channel. Um, I'm just going to breathe in and breathe out, nice and tall through the body. Just going to sink the hips, lengthen through the spine, so you feel the head floats up, you feel the weight sink down, you want to relax your shoulders you want to feel that you've got lots of room in your body so feel the um, the shoulders elbows wrists hands tall through the body and feel the ground under your feet so take a bit of time to check your feet and gently draw the toes in and sink the hips and lengthen through the spine. So yeah, I've had some apologies from from Keith and I can't remember who else said they were, couldn't come, but there's a few people missing <laughs> this morning. So this is the elite group. And we're breathing. Focus on your breath, feel the ground under your feet, relax around your jaw, so make sure you're, you're nice and relaxed around your jaw, yeah, you can put your hands on your jaw actually, sort of that, that Edward Munch style and just let it, let your jaw really relax and let go, so we're just going to do some, um, so I spent the whole day yesterday, I was at meditation retreat and it was all about cultivating loving kindness and um, sort of nurturing and things, really, really good. Okay, then place your hands on your heart centre, we're just going to think warm thoughts there. And then place your hands on your lower dantian and think warm open thoughts there too so you, you want to feel that your whole body's got lots of space in got lots of room it's feeling comfortable and then relax the shoulders sink your hips feel the ground under your feet so good contact with the ground and we're just going to turn the waist Turn the waist nice and relaxed. That's it, yeah, very good. So we turn the waist. So hopefully over the next few weeks we'll be getting more people turning up to this class because this is now one of my classes that I've got being sponsored, being um, supported. I, I need to phone up the charity because uh, I don't know how they're supposed to pay me. I just <laughs> 
<laughs> Never mind. And uh, we're, we're just nice and nice and relaxed. And we're all breathing. Fabulous. Very good. Very good indeed. And you just feel the... Um, Fabulous. So we're just turning our waist and letting our letting our shoulders relax. It's all very nice. Just feel the waist turn, relax the lower back. Breathe, just breathe in, breathe out. Notice your breath as it goes in. Notice your breath as it comes out and then you follow, you follow the breath. Breathing. Dear, looks like we've got a couple of people stuck. <laughs> Never mind. Morning. You're right. Well done. Well done making it. Brilliant. Hey, well done. You got on. <laughs> oh dear. Yeah, don't worry. Just join in. Don't, just, just join in. It's fine. No problem. Yeah, you know, pe people have various reasons for not, not being able to get here bang on 11. That's absolutely fine. Just turn up when you can. Join in when you can. And if you can't join in, you can watch the video after. So you can catch up and it's all absolutely fine. There we go. So we, we're going to be working on feet again today. I have got a brand new exercise that I learned at quarter past ten. So it's uh, it's all cool. I'll, re I'll read that one in a minute, Ames. I'll read it at that at the end. And then we're just breathing in and out. And just open the arms. Because, you know, sometimes Zoom plays up or the internet plays up or... You've had one of those days or whatever, it's fine, just come, it's fine. So we're opening the arms, we're opening the arms, nice and relaxed. Okay, check your posture. We'll just carry on with the loosening and we'll just take, we'll just pace ourselves today. It's cold outside. You want to make sure your body is being nurtured and cared for. Give yourself some TLC. Brilliant. There we are. And we're, we're just letting go, we're just letting go here. So yeah, I spent the whole day on Sunday thinking kind thoughts. It was felt, I highly recommend it. I felt great. And uh, because we were doing about um, self-care and loving kindness, I very kindly and compassionately ate the last third of my jar of chocolate spread with a spoon. 
you know, that's how enlightened I was. So there we go. <laughs> I had loads of salad though, you know, yin and yang and all that. No, nuts and salad and, oh, lovely. Beetroot, brilliant. Okay, here we go. <laughs> Just, you know. Just really floppy fire the arms. Have a have a look from the side. How are we doing? Yeah, okay, Rela stop a minute, stop a minute. You wanna really relax your shoulders. Make them really soft, and you make them really soft by sinking your hips. So let's just sink our hip. Actually, let's feel the ground under the feet first. Now sink your hips to give your shoulders somewhere to sink to. Now find that really quiet, still place. So there's this still place inside. And we're breathing, we're breathing, that's it. Right, let's try that again. Oh, what relief. Let's turn the palms up now actually, so we've got this nice gentle opening in the chest. Like, you know, Imagine you're a nun and you're standing on a hill singing. <laughs> there we go. That's it. That's better. That's it. Bit, bit more, bit more wider, Charlie, mate. Bit more wider. Yeah. Good. Good effort. Good effort. Okay. And then there we go. Oh. So. I am imminently doing, finally getting around to doing the loosening exercise video after this class. Hooray, finally. Part two. Um, we'll be looking at the more unusual loosening exercises, not the basic ones. Um, And also Dragon Serves Teacups. I got asked about Dragon Serves Teacup. I will do that. So do feel free to send me an email if there's anything you want me to do a video on. I am more, more than happy, more than happy to do that. So feel your weight transfer. Feel your weight transfer and just breathing, 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 breathing. Fabulous.
Okay. <sighs> so just let the arms drop. Let the arms drop. That's it. Very good, everybody. the hips softly gaze forwards listen behind like the eyes of a sleepy tiger so so we've got some very cool balance video uh, balance moves that I might even make a video of it ever stolen leg exercises <laughs> Now she's quite okay me teaching stuff as soon as I've learned it off her. She, she approved, so I'm very happy with that. So thanks, Eva. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, so, um, yeah, forwards and back. So yeah, it's about being present. You see, I've, I've been hearing people saying, oh, it would be really good when we can all get back to real life Hang on, this is real life, everybody. Sorry to wake you all up, but this is real life right now. This is this is how it is at the moment. So it's not like we're in a waiting room or nothing, waiting for something better to come along. Make your own better stuff now. It's much easier. It saves you having to rely on other things, you know? So own your space. Relax. Breathing in and out. There we go. Very good. So we just we just turn in the waist, turn the waist. Very good. So yeah, my next um, mission is to be able to do a proper full side split because I'm not letting a guy ten years my senior outstretch me. <laughs> Brilliant. There we go. That's it. That's it. Very good. Okay. Wobbling. Wobbling. So find your feet. Tune into the feet. Little shake out, lovely, lovely. Okay, dragon serves teacup. So like a slightly, not a huge, you know, miniature pony stance, not horse stance. So like this, elbows forward, rounded shape, rounded shape. We go ten, one, two, three, four. Shoulder, one, two, 
three, four, nice, five, six, seven, and eight. Other direction, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Other side, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Other direction, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. So with your spinal wave, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Other direction, one, two. So I don't know how much we're actually gonna get done today. Three, four, but it'll all be good for you, five, six, seven, eight. Okay, now feet. What you wanna do is really tune into your feet and just give your toes a bit of a wiggle. I will actually, I will read what, what, what did you say? Oh, no worries, mate. Yeah, no worries. I do the same. I do the same. I, I, I have actually, because of, um, because of the way my brain works, I actually find it very difficult to sense the passing of time. So I never, you know, <laughs> it's fine. So we're just wiggling our, we're wiggling our toes. And then, right now what you do is just move your, like that. So you're just six, seven, eight, and then lift the toes. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Just raise the heels, one, two, as you can have the, the arms either down or on, on, on the uh, hips, six, seven, eight. And then for fun, raise the toes and raise the heel at the same time. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Let's do it again. Two, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight and then for fun my fun swing the arms as well one two three four five six seven eight so thank you laura stone for teaching me that brilliant laura stone in amsterdam fabulous nice and tall now what we're gonna do is we're going to put your hands on your back of your waist going to raise the leg and we're just going to swing forwards and back. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Now, if you need to, you can use a wall. If you're using a wall, you want the leg on the outside because of the rules. I will not use a wall. I will use my, uh, I've been working my balance all weekend. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Okay, let's, uh, I will consult my notebook. Okay, this is called Phoenix Spreads Its Wings and I learnt it, actually I probably learnt it about half past ten. I've written a little squiggly diagram that looks terrible. I, I drew some stick people. And you, you start like that with your with your hands. That's it. And then what we do? Actually, we'll do the hands on their own, and we do the feet on their own, and then we'll put them together. We go like that, like a little. Uh, remember that game, Space Invaders? It's <laughs> no, okay. I don't think they. Out, out to the corners, out to the corners. So your, your, your hands are following the direction of the fingers. Right. 
yeah and then what you do is we'll do a kick we go kick kick like you're on a chorus line kick kick Kick. Yeah, the other important thing I learned on Sunday was the importance of using humour. So sorry about that, everybody. I'm sure I'll, I'll get over it eventually. It's a really, really good day. I highly recommend spending an entire day thinking about being thoughtful and kind. It just, yeah, brilliant. Just what I needed, just what I needed. So it was uh, Christina Feldman and Chris Cullen. They're both very highly experienced meditation teachers. Very, very good. So now we go like this and we go, hey. It's very good. It's like Bangra, isn't it? Thank you, Evoca Scuba, for teaching me this wonderful move. It's quite uplifting, isn't it? <laughs> Just what you need during the pandemic. Highly recommended. Phoenix spreads its wings. I, 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 I've called it Phoenix does a bit of Bangra. There you go. So have a, have a look from the side, yeah? Have a look from the side. So like that. And I'm not fully, fully straightening my legs. I'm still keeping a little bit of give in the knees. <laughs> yeah. Phoenix spreads its wings. There we go. Phoenix spreads its wings. Okay, let's do... Um, the, pi the pigeon one. Now, remember when we was doing donkey kick last week? We transfer our weight, we lift the heel, and then we kick slightly back as if you've, you're at a party. Remember those? And... Um, one of your mates is about to say something because they've drunk too much so you very gently push their leg with your foot and then they'll be quiet i'll try it out when i don't actually go to parties really uh but should i ever go to one <laughs> should i make any friends i'll be able to uh there we go that's it okay now we do the pigeon pigeon flying pigeon so we're we're working on our we're working on our um, on our balance for the next few weeks and getting it super brilliant. So, yeah, stop, st stop a moment. If you have a look, as I transfer my weight, I actually sink down, and that will make it easier for me to stand on one leg. So try really sinking your hips and also connecting through the body. Feel that your whole body is engaged and connected. Flying pigeon. And you're looking forward, you're listening behind. Fabulous. Okay. Um. We've got that one as well. That's the you point your toe. So you kind of. That was another Phoenix one. Okay. We'll do one more and then we better give our arms a bit of a rest, haven't we? Okay. Let's go back to this one. And then what we'll do, we'll just tune into our breathing. So, um, the breath is a very useful way of anchoring yourself. So 
place your hand on your lower dantian, place your other hands on your back and just breathe into your hands. So just feel the breath. And try the other side. Okay. Next, let's do the the little kick one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Now, this time we're going to stay on one leg and we're going to do the same leg. We're going to go one, two, three, four, five. I'm going to put the foot down. And if you need to use the wall, you can use the wall. Make sure the legs on the outside. One, two, tall through the spine. Three, four, hips level. Five. Great. Okay, now we're going to transfer our weight and then go out to the side. One, two, three, four, five. Then transfer your weight. Bring the foot in. So now you're going to put your, your right foot in and your right foot out. One, two, three, four, without transferring the weight until we do this bit. So let's do another round each leg. So keep your weight on that leg. One, two, three, four, five. And then the, the feet just, just gently feel their way into it. One, two, three, four, five. Fabulous. Okay, let's, uh, I'll show you this from the side. We're going to go one, two, three, four, five. Then we're going to step. And then we're going to go one, two, three, four, five, and then step. Just do uh, do some really good character building leg exercises for fun, my fun. Yeah. And then we'll do some arm movements in a minute. I just wanted to get the legs working. Okay, so we go one, two. So the right foot out and the right foot in. Three, four. So Tai Chi Koki, five. Now it's your left foot in and your left foot out. One, two, three. Yeah, my nieces love that song. Four, five, and then stuff give your legs a shake Whoa. this will make your legs very strong and it's really really good for your balance okay what we're gonna do is we're gonna do Phoenix um, monkey King takes a seat and then we're gonna go back and do some ones that we're all familiar with and then do have a look at white uh, crane flying crane and also have a look at dragonfly skims the skims the water as a little walkie thing 
just to keep working at the balance but we'll we'll kind of backtrack and do some real basic qigong exercises for for health um but we'll do monkey king first so i'll just just show you monkey king takes a seat so remember you're a king so you want to have your sleepy tiger eyes and you want to be like surveying your kingdom so you want to have this panoramic awareness that's like surround sounds panoramic look it up it's great <laughs> so we go like this one now if you want to squat all the way down you can but you want to keep that lengthening uh, you want to keep that lengthening in the, the that lengthening in the spine lengthening in the spine yeah okay so I'll, I'll show it from the diagonal so get your get king like that's it taller everybody and now practice your sleepy tiger eyes so this soft focused relaxed but alert gaze and we're we're nice and relaxed we're sinking oh yeah yeah excuse me for having to wear my reading glasses my normal glasses have gone missing again so now everything looking slightly blue it's fine it's a nice look it's a nice look so here we go ready and begin just nice and take your time one that's it you're the monkey king two taking a seat and then you get off your chair and survey your kingdom three that's it so yeah you can go faster if you want charlie that's fine four it's perfect very good that's it and five that was so good we'll do one more that was good let's do another one very good everybody five uh, i mean six right i can count no i seem to count to fives eights and uh okay back to this one okay before we continue let us pause for a water break water break um not all teachers do water breaks but i quite like them because you want to especially because you want to think about nurturing the body and also giving yourself space When you're having your water actually yeah let, let's let's throw a bit of mindfulness in as i was doing about that yesterday so you want to you want to fill the cup in your hand you want to feel it when it touches your lip try not to spill it one of the things though if you're doing mindful uh drinking sometimes you end up spilling it all down your front don't do that and then uh let it sit in your mouth for a bit before you you swallow it and then when you feel feel the liquid actually going down and see where it disappears in your body it's quite interesting it gets to about there and then it kind of seems to vanish see i know how to have fun yeah mm. and then it just means you've got a little bit of space so next time you have a tea break which is hopefully going to be at 12 o'clock rule five just sit notice the chair under your um sitting bones notice the angle of your arm when you drink your tea notice the other hand resting and just turn it into a whole sensory experience mindful tea drinking i first did mindful tea drinking with peter shearer the guy playing the music on the piano here because he did a, a few courses all about mindfulness in oxford the sort of the big the big place where they all learn about it and um the other thing i did was i ate uh i ate a grape mindfully that was interesting because i've never really noticed them so it's about taking your time to notice what's going on is the is the moral of that story so rooting down
keep breathing keep your shoulders relaxed just feel feel through the whole of the body that you're connected you're rooted to the ground and you've got this soft light feeling throughout the body and the torso and the arms soft and light like water and air and change to the wild goose and just feel this lovely openness in the body you've got lots of space you've got time you just oh lovely really good everybody change just feel that the whole of the body is connected the whole of the body is engaged shoulders dragon plucks the stars from the sky lovely everybody really good soft smooth and slow and you just just take your time you, you can rush about after yeah but just for now we're being thoughtful we're being kind to ourselves and considerate and respecting our our limits of when we're moving. So you know, not everyone can move the same amount, and that's fine. From a calm place of stillness and clarity. Stillness and clarity. Keep breathing. Let's do one more each side. That's lovely. gently sway from one uh, bubbling well to the other so you feel the, the weight shift through the bubbling well so the point just behind the ball of each foot that's it and you want to you want to relax and soften your knees so the knees are soft because you're making room in all your joints and just feeling that you've got loads of space and then shift and turn shift and turn and then bring the hands round to Cheng Bao. Or do the bear. So imagine a great big cuddly panda bear.
circle in the ball. So we're just doing a, a smaller version. Well, this one's also called um, Lion Plays With The Wall, but I've got another version of it, which we'll do in a minute, actually. It's kind of loosely related to the uh, health dance and um, tree cheek on change directions. have a look at um, the that one so let's just do the arms so you come up like this yeah that's it and then you come down you come that's it yeah good you come up and you come down so you just need to work on getting it smoother but you've got the basic gist so you come up And you come down. So here we go. Now, now what you want to do is you want to, uh, yeah. Let's just just separate this bit. So we're doing like this. I'll show you from the side. So it's as if you're just about to sit down, and then you change your mind, and you're coming up through the crown of the head, through the bubble, um, Yonchuan point, uh, not Yonchuan, Bahue point, in the the crown of the head, Bahue point. Okay, now when you do it, you're now engaging the legs a bit more, yeah? Good. Okay, now we'll do two more. Do two more because we're getting this, we're getting this all nicely connected up. Like, okay, I think that's one more now. One more now. transfer and then just let the foot hang so you want to relax that ankle create some space in the ankle and you can have it sort of quite low down you can have it I wouldn't have it more than a 90 degree angle I wouldn't have it more than that because that's too much you want it you want it at there or a little bit lower that's it that's it good okay we're cooking we're cooking okay let's carry on and what you might want to do is as arms come up, you might even want to come down and then up. Just for a little bit of variety. So we just go. And like nice and light with the arms. So you'll you'll feel this is doing wonders for your legs. Blame Eva, it's all her fault. Yeah, Friday we did some absolutely horrible leg exercises, didn't we? <laughs> really horrible. We're gonna do them again. I've been practicing them at the weekend because I, I can't do them at all. Absolutely horrendous. Check it out on the YouTube channel, Tai Chi Fitness. And 
It'd make your eyes water. <laughs> one, one more on each side. One more on each side. Lovely. Okay, and then we'll do the, the warm up for Dragonfly Skims the Water. So have a look. So there's a slightly different slightly different body mechanics on Dragonfly Skims the Water. Yeah, we'll finish off with Tiger play, a uh, Lion Plays with a Ball, because that's one I learned from Barry. So we're going like this. So there's a spiral, 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 like that. But you want to make sure your knee is in line with the toes, especially with the leg you're standing on. And then with the, with the arms, you turn the waist, and one arm is behind and one arm is in front. But the behind arm is slightly... So if you use your picture, line it up with your head. And then you come back down. And then line the back arm up with your head. There you go. Like that. Okay. Great. Uh, we've got a few minutes left. Let's just... Right. Demonstration. Observe. Observe. So it... Like this. And then we go like that and oh that's better sorry hang on let me just show that again now I've got my hips in the right get your hips lined up don't do it rubbish and then from the side it looks like this here we go I'll do it from the side okay dragonfly does a warm up So we'll, we'll persevere with this one. We'll do it as a walking exercise next week because we, we are rapidly running out of time. Sorry about that. We'll do more structured stuff when we go back to the 18, but I just want to kind of free flow it a bit and just work on feet and balance and leg strength for the next few weeks because I think we're going to... It's good to work on. Okay, so then what you do, you hold a ball and you... You can start stepping. This is called Lion Plays with a Ball. This is loosely stolen from Barry. I'm sure I'm doing it wrong, but this will do for now. So he does this chill out, a Wednesday evening chill out session at seven o'clock to late on a Wednesday. And I go, I'm going, I love it. It's really good. But he often does Lion Plays with a Ball. So you can kind of, basically similar to, to the health dance in that you're just kind of making it up as you go along. It's like, Tai Chi, Qigong Jazz. There we go. And you can just move around and imagine you're a lion and you're playing with a ball. So there's this connectivity and aliveness through your body. Because cats move beautifully, they do. Okay, we'll, we'll put the lion down and step away from it, and then we're just uh, breathing. <laughs> Breathe, yeah, sorry about the humour today. It's what happens when you spend a whole day meditating on the concepts of joy, kind, being kind and open-hearted. And... <sighs> yeah. I'm definitely feeling better than I did on sat Saturday. So uh, with all the doom and gloom in the news and then it was just like, oh, just relax. Just enjoy whatever it is you got. And I'm like, oh, okay, yeah, yeah, that's good. That's good. Lovely, one more time. And then embrace the tiger, return to the mountain. So we're all nice and relaxed, we're all just chilled, just, oh, fabulous. So open the chest, make it, bring it into the chest, breathe in, 
sink down, sink down, lovely. Lengthen through the spine. Lovely, everyone. Sink down. Tune into the ground. Really feel that contact with the feet. So we've been working on feet today. Let go in the lower back. Check that you're breathing okay. Nice and tall. Feel the, the, the neck lengthen. And then Better see if we get it to work today. So rub your hands together and give your face a lovely polish. So we all look super young today. Super young today, very good. Or we just oh smoothing out any Rub the hands together and then give your lower back a rub. Oh, wonderful, wonderful, wonderful. Yeah, that's the best bit, isn't it? Next to the tea. Oh, fabulous. So just feel the ground under your feet and lengthen through the body. Tune in to your root and this calm, quiet, strong place full of clarity but also peaceful. Make a fist with the right hand, left hand over the top, bring your feet together and bow. Brilliant. Yeah, well done everyone. That was a great session. Good job. Good job. Yeah, I better stop the